find a way out. Saw any of them again. Laura, you're alive. Hey! Get off of me! Let go of her! You waited so long. Sam! He took her. He took Sam. Who took Sam? A man like the one who killed Stan. Get back! Get back! I'm that kind of craft. Sure you are. You just don't know it yet. Hey everyone, you just finished watching the new Tomb Raider trailer exclusively from E3 2012. And uh, I don't know about you, but I am crazy excited about this game. Uh, it's, I don't know, it's something that when we saw it last year, a lot of people were kind of like, I don't know, new look on Tomb Raider. But this just encourages and just throws so much more at you, and I'm super excited about it. Well, about you, well to get vulgar for a second, when I saw the new model for the Tomb Raider, I got naked immediately. I, fe <laughs> I fell in love. Yes, uh, yeah, I, I mean, like... But that's just I, me. <laughs> so a lot of the trailer uh, was showing off, you know, some of the gameplay, and, and a lot of people are saying it's very Uncharted-esque. And I see no fault in that. Like, I, I, Uncharted is a great game, um, and, and I think that what, un, what uh, Tomb Raider has been doing so far with it and what we've seen, the little that we've seen, uh, is, is just taking all the good things from Uncharted and, and including them in there. Well, yeah, I mean, and, pr pretty much like Uncharted is one of my favorite games of all time. So being like Uncharted is not a bad thing. Yeah. And it's not going to be the same thing as Uncharted because it's Tomb Raider. So. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, like the the shooting the deer and everything like like how is that gonna be implemented in the gameplay i'm just well you know. so what had me excited about all of that was they seemed like they were putting a lot of emphasis on survival within it right she's making the mm -hmm. fire she's hunting a deer she's roasting the deer and i think that could actually turn out to be really cool because it was it was a pretty good mix with the trailer you had the survival aspects and then you also had the action kind of set piece moments the uncharted moments if you will <laughs> Yeah, and, and I think it they really uh, kind of unfolded the story a little bit more, and that's something that, like, you know, a lot of the older Tomb Raiders aren't necessarily known for their stories. Um, you know, it's a lot of the gameplay and that kind of stuff. And, and there's, the, there's some story in there, but this the, one... The had, older Tomb Raiders are known for boobs. Yeah, uh, but, like, as we learn more about this, it just you, it unfolds as a, a deeper and deeper story. You get to see, you know, that she's investigating farther into the island. She found someone that she knows, and then all of a sudden, you know, people try to rape her and stuff. And, and she kicks like... a guy in the balls. <laughs> so it's 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 a whole bunch of craziness. I I'm just I'm 
unbelievably excited about this game. I was this was already my second most anticipated game of this year. Unfortunately, it was delayed till next year. Mm-hmm. Uh, but it, it know, right? remains that it remains uh, number one or two. It, it's number two, but just ever so slightly. I don't know. Uh, but it's it's right up there with uh, my most anticipated games that are coming out here in the near future. So. Uh, you guys, if you enjoyed the trailer, remember to subscribe for some more trailer content from E3. Definitely subscribe for some more Tomb Raider content because, hey, we're going to be uh, covering the crap out of this game. So. I mean, did you guys hear Dewey squeal about this game? He's excited. <laughs> just, just a little. Just a little. Um, thank you guys, though. And uh, with that, we'll catch you guys on the flip side.